Right, here we are at the 10th Beaumont family reunion. 2006. As you can see, Chalk Hill Youth Centre. Right. Okay. First family member. Oh, sorry, what take you? <laughs> Don't, do you feel You're doing it right now. Okay, are you excuse. Greetings to each other right here. So thank you. Yes. Are you happy to be here? Yes. Yay! Alright, what you do? I'm asking you a favor. Turn to the person next to you and say, I'm happy to be here today. I'm happy to be here. Therefore, 
we know that they left a legacy behind. And this legacy they left behind, we hope that we, as a family that come very well afterward, can always have a lead from their group. And I sincerely hope that we continue to do so. As for the children, I have a special say on the children. We are praying and hoping that these children will adapt this principle by looking after the parents, looking after them, keep them, and teach them the way of the family's way, which I know is a good way. Maybe we do not have the opportunity to get the kind of a facility they have, we have today, because the fact of the matter is that we didn't have the resources. But showing the love that these, these ladies and gentlemen show to us, they give us the incentive that we must carry on to help and to think under these conditions because they are good. The family, we live under these. And if you notice that our children always have some attitude that we today, of the old, the elder one, would have. And I'm just saying to you that we must consider them and regard them as that's a family tree, something we always tend to, to maintain. The love for each and every one to be kind to one another. And I'm sure we have seen this. In 1987, we started this family reunion. And what I'm saying is that there are few years we missed out. What I'm saying is that it all started at my house when we decided to make up this family reunion. And so on, we travel from there. And today, we can see the very interest in it because we were all concerned, me and Keith Bowman, when we started, we were saying we want the family to know each other, to get together, and the reason for it is we want to be united. Because you understand that united we stand, divided we fall. Therefore, then we are a family together, and we just want to keep this going. We just want to make sure that we know each other, love each other, and continue on the trend from the day when I first know this family. Sierra Bowman and Alfred Bowman, they are a, a pair of people that created us today, and we must respect it and regard it. And I can say to you, I'm pleased and I'm satisfied that we are taking a leap from that book and continue on that trend. Therefore, then, we must understand that this is the purpose of recording together. This is the reason why we are here, and I'm pleased for that. Yes? Well, could you stand with me, please? Because I want to say a word of prayer. moment I approach the children of grace. Father God, I'm looking at you because you are the God in whom we depend. We know, Father God, you are able to keep us and to guide us. This the family of Alfred and Sierra Beaumont. Right now, before you, Lord, we represent ourselves. Knowing, Father God, that you are able to keep us and guide us. We ask your sincere protection. We know, Father God, these children need, O oh Father God, to be monitored by the, by the mother and father. And we pray, Father God, we are in a world which is full of troubles and trials. You say in your words that the children, we should train them the way they should grow. And when they become older, they will never depart. And we want to know, Father God, that they are able in this world to be guided by you. You are the great guider, you are the great protector. You are the beginning and you are the ending of all things. You are the savior which we trust. You are the one who we depend. And now before you, I present this family. One family, we are in unity. We are in one. And I ask your blessing upon each and every one. I ask you, Father, that you will not fail to apply for what you are the Lord. You said anything we desire, we must pray. And we shall get it. And we shall, if we ask, we shall have it. And I just only pray, Father God, that today you may bless the table, the meal we are about to eat, the drink we are about to have, whatever it is that 
pray your blessing upon you, Father God. And I look to you today that you will help each and every one to be happy, to be rejoicing, and that they, at the end of the day, they will be happy to say, thank you, Father, because you are God and God alone. I pray you may bless each and every one. Now we pray. I ask these blessings in Jesus' name. Amen.
sorry, Mars. I've, I've got to ask you these questions, yeah? Not too close, though. No, not too close. Not too close. <laughs> right, OK. So the organisation, the planning, this is the day. In your opinion, how's it been? Nerve-wracking. <laughs> nerve-wracking? Yes. But why nerve-wracking? We do this well, with our eyes shut, though. No? I tell you something, it will be easier to deal with children than adults. Oh dear. Yeah, the adults are very hard work. In what respect? They don't listen. The children listen. Right. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> you know? Yeah. Okay. That's a fact. The children listen, the adults don't. So they're not listening Pro to... Proven tonight, right. when we tried to do something, there was a lot of yapping all the way through. I know. While the children were so quiet. That's right. You know? I did rate the way the, the, the guys got them to do the uh, minute silence. Yeah. Uh, and they did a minute silence. It, it was a little bit of chatting going on. The still. children was quiet, the but children the adults were quiet. There's a few adults on a dominoes table. <laughs> I've, got, I've got them on camera, so I've got evidence of who <laughs> they can't deny who, who it was. <laughs> Certainly, you know? but so far, I mean, like, we're sort of close on nine o'clock of the day. To me, it's been brilliant. quite a success. It's been brilliant. Been, apart from the adults being awkward, it's been brilliant. <laughs> <laughs> I hope I wasn't one of them. <laughs> I, I'm not going to say nothing. You're not going to say that. nothing. Well, I can tell you now, for the record, I will certainly was not. <laughs> <laughs> I will take that as your own, you know. <laughs> All right, thanks. Well, uh, listen, mate, thanks for putting it on, because uh, last year we did it, and I know the endeavour yeah, the trouble, the organisation, the meetings, the time you got to spend away from your yeah. family in order to... And that was 20 it. of you. There was only four of us. Four. Well, that could work out in an advantageous, actually, <laughs> because too many cooks spoil the broth. Yeah. And in this I case, something. yes, the broth was very yeah. sweet tasting. The broth was very nice tonight. I thought it was nice. I mean, it was, I, nice. it was very nice. Yeah, the, from the... Hey. There's some more curry you know, on okay. rice. That's right. I'm, I, I haven't had my share yet. <laughs> and I'm glad you said it. I've just been in the kitchen. I'm thinking, I don't feel so hungry. There's Should plenty. I go on help? Yes. Fantastic. There's plenty. But what I personally want, what I really want, is a bottle of that red Beaumont wine. I just gave three away. Three? Yes. Did I give a fourth one? away two. Well, it depends on what you've got. I'll have a look. Right, I love a bottle of that red. Right. You'll have to come with me, but off camera because I don't want nobody okay. to see. It. Right, okay. You know? Okay, I'm cutting from now. All right. The venue for the ninth. Beaumont Reunion 2005. It's now about 10 to 11 and the show is about to begin. Alright, Jerome Carris, two young Beaumies. See my head here? And Marcus. And you see my head here? We can see your head. I'm focusing on the uh, night tick as well, Jerome, alright? Hi Yo. Marcus. Yeah, right, mate, how you doing? Fine. And uh, we've got more Bomies arriving. Oh, yeah. Hold on. Sit down there. More Bomies arriving. I don't know where the rest of his posse is, but what? Yep, yeah, they're all starting to arrive now. Yeah, this is a Bomie reunion number nine. It's about to get on the way. In fact, it's on the way. Yeah, because we've made it on the way. Okay. Everybody ready? Well, I'm just kidding. You've been taken already, mate. Huh? You've all been. Oh, right, I see. Right. Yeah. Hello. That's David. David, yeah. Yes, sure, man. Sure. Don't make the coming without pass, you know. Look, can you take over? I've got to go in about 10 minutes. Oh, my goodness. What's the sign in? 
Yes. Isn't it that red one in front of you there? No, we've got a red. We've got a red one. We've got a Bermuda one. Who's this? Kevin. Yes, yeah, done. Yes, done. If I'm on camera, still it on. Because you cheer for your cheer too much. Because you had treble here, Jen. But you still can't tell me who my dad is. Hi everybody, how you doing? Hi, it's Gloria, how you doing? Yeah, alright, nice to pop in here. Nice to see you. Hi, to Jesslyn. Good. Another year, another year. And here we have Mr. Porteous and Son doing their thing at reception. Oh, look at that.